air around us. Children, are you able to see air? You can't, but you can feel it. Now let us learn about air in this lesson. Air is around us everywhere. Air contains different kinds of gases. Among them, oxygen is very important because all the plants, animals and human beings breathe oxygen to live. The dust released by vehicles are mixed with air and becomes polluted. There are some germs in the air which cause ill. While yawning, coughing or sneezing, you should cover your mouth. Do you know how do the wet clothes get dry? The wet clothes get dry when the water evaporates or turns into steam due to sunshine. Plants keep the air fresh and clean so that we can breathe fresh air. If we breathe polluted air, we become ill because disease causing germs enter our body. Properties of air Though air is not seen particularly, it has some properties. It fills space, it has weight and gives shape to the things. Here is an experiment with balls. Take two deflated balls. Fill air in one of them. Now test which one is heavier. Certainly the air filled ball is heavier. It has given proper shape also to the ball. So that we can say the air fills space also. Air can move things. We have come to know that air has some properties. At the same time we too can feel that when it moves. This can be known when you run very fast or ride a bicycle very fast. You feel the air moves against your face. Moving air is called wind. Wind helps us in many ways. Some of them are to sail a boat, to fly a kite, to move up a hot air balloon, to fly aeroplane and to get wet clothes dry. Clouds are moved by air and causes rain. A gentle wind is called breeze. It gives pleasure. When the wind is strong and blows very fast, it is called a storm. Storm causes damage to plants, houses and animals. Look at the picture that dam is caused by storm.